Hello! I am Mac, at least for a day, and everything's going to be okay. On today's Dreams feature game, we're going to be playing a story-driven game called Be Seeing You. I found this, and I have not played it yet, but it looks really good, so let's check it out. Start. The year is 1976, and you are a British agent, tired and conflicted with the decisions that have been forced. You hastily storm into your superior's office and slam down your resignation note before being made to complete one last assignment. At first, you outright refuse, but as the chances of your resignation being rejected become a concern, you most begrudgingly accept and leave for your assignment. The mission is a success. You board a very busy commercial flight, first class, intending to fly back to London and live a life of your own without the confinements to conform and memorial ambiguity. The journey, the journey back is not without its own problems. A storm bellows and bangs on the wings of your plane. You take two sleeping pills to aid the turbulence and soon close your eyes and go to sleep. And so this is where we begin. A number six productions game created edited and produced by Morgan the one presenting to you be seeing you Neat intro. I wonder if this is going to be like a creepy horror like game. Whoa. Find out what happened. Or maybe it's like a mystery. Wow, this is a really cool environment. Hmm. Untouched. He said, hmm, untouched. Curiosity is rewarded by exploration. It is the square root of something. Uh, certain objects can be interacted with square and some rare activated by investi- some are activated by investigation. The root of inquisitive. Hello? Oh, there we go. Couldn't move. Keep- camera keeps- Turning. Ah, someone is being at me. Hello. What? Uh, I kept turning my key. Oh, there's arrows. Well, I want to just look around for a little bit. Ah. Uh, Stop sting at me. Where's that coming from? Ah. Okay. Let's see. Am I supposed to do something here? It's got arrows pointing somewhere. Looks like it's just telling me to go over here where I was. Oh, that's the sound of the 
bathroom opening. I thought someone was like saying Psst, for me to come over and talk to them. Uh, remember some objects in certain cupboards next to shelves can be interacted with by pressing square. Be inquisitive. Not all are prompted. Now I guess that means I just have to push square on everything, like a point and click adventure. Open with square, shut with triangle. Cool. Hmm. Can't seem to get out of here. Can open the toilet. Square's not doing anything on anything else that I can see. Can I open the ventilation shaft? I, mean, I don't think I could fit in there, even if I could. Oh, I found something. Here we go. Why not try the painting? Someone's playing games with me. <laughs> uh, try the painting with the knife? I can't seem to pick up the knife. Try the painting. Well, yeah, I, I was looking at the painting. There we go. Hmm. I wonder if I use the knife. <laughs> I was trying to pick up the knife. Just let me do what I was trying to do. There we go. Okay. See you soon. Uh oh. Is it a trap? Who's doing this? Who are you? <laughs> Is this like a secret agent game? It says something about you being some kind of secret agent, I think. I'm still in here? What? I thought they were going to kidnap me and take me somewhere. It's back. Oh, that's weird. Was the knife? Huh. Oh, it's a different bathroom. It just looks the same. Who the hell am I? So they did kidnap me and take me somewhere. Just made it look like I was in the same place. What? But the bathroom changed. Explore the area. Remember, some objects can be interacted with square. Yes, I get it. <laughs> You've told me enough times. Fashionable and also identical to the clothes I have on now. That's creepy. So is this some kind of secret agent thing and I'm being recruited again and this is my changing room? Make yourself at home. You're going to something. Level one pass. Hmm, this might come in useful. You're giving, you're going to love it here. Be seeing you. It's definitely a mystery kind of game. Number six, that's the name of his game development group, I guess. 
company, whatever. Option one, extended living room. Option two, additional floor space. Oh, I'll try that in a little bit. I'm going to explore the room as it is before I change it. Is that waterfall going backwards? No, it's going down. Oh, you can turn it off. Aha! An inside waterfall. Checkers. Your your dealt your cards. At least you use the right your. Oh, bedroom. Ooh, cool mirror. You can make something that looks reflective like a mirror, but unfortunately it won't actually reflect your character. I think to make an actual mirror, what you'd have to do is you'd have to make a separate puppet on the other side of glass, make it look like it was doing exactly what you're doing. No peeking, number six. Oh, so I'm like a secret agent and my code name or my number is number six probably. <sighs> Wood will be deactivated upon exiting the room. Oh. <laughs> it's like the love love sweet mode uh, I knew it would be a disco ball I was like is it gonna be a disco ball <laughs> oh man oh my gosh <laughs> oh yeah this is funny okay how do I leave the room though There we go. Get to the village. I know how to get to the village. But I want to play around with the room some more. There was something... Here we go. Okay, extended living room. Ooh. Cool. Okay, option two, additional floor space. Oh, okay, he's just switched between the two. What? That was weird. This system isn't a toy. If you keep pressing the buttons, you will break it, and we will have to take it away from you. Once is enough. Oh, now I have to try pushing it again. I broke it. Oh, yep, I broke it. <laughs> I broke it. That's funny. That's funny that you can break it. Okay, let's move on. The village. The villages. You should have your voice heard. Vote now in our annual election. For who should govern you? <laughs> Message brought to you by number two. Visit the tourist shop for more details. The village, a place neither here or there. A change of geography every day. Brought to you by the village. Huh, this is starting to remind me of Bioshock. I've never actually played Bioshock, but I have watched videos about the general story. It's like you get taken to this 
underground. It looks like we're underground, or either underwater in... It's underwater in the first Bioshock game, but it was like this place. It was made to be sort of a utopia, but of course it didn't work out that way. Huh. This is kind of reminding me of that. The village Blofeld Tunnel. Currently designing. Thank you so much for playing. Oh no, this is the end already? I thought there was more to it than this. Darn it. Oh well, that was pretty cool. All of the uh, the weird room room changing stuff. Darn, I thought I thought there was more to the game than this, but still pretty cool. Can I go back in the village or out of the village? Good, I can. Uh oh, oh good. Well, that was pretty cool. So he's still working on it. I thought there was more to it than this, but oh well. I like all the room changing mechanics though. Um, what? Seem to be stuck in a loading screen or something. I can still move though, that's weird. Oh well. I think we've seen all of what is currently in the game. Let me see. Yeah. Exit house. Yep. Yep, that's all that there is right now. There's a lot of these sm How do you make... You can make scenes different sizes? That's good to know. But yeah, it looks like that's currently all that's in the game. But yeah, that was pretty cool. Looking forward, I'm going to follow this game. Looking forward to seeing more. Um, this guy's definitely working hard on the game. He's put in a lot of interesting mechanics. And it's an interesting story-driven game. And the story is starting to look a little bit like... Bioshock maybe, like some kind of underground place that's supposed to be like a utopia, maybe, because it talked about like voting for your governors and all this stuff, so it might be some kind of dystopian mystery kind of game, I don't know, but I will definitely be following and watching as this game develops, but for now, I have been Mac, thank you for joining me for a day, and remember, everything is going to be okay.